Here is five ways on how you can get a blurry background for your videos. Getting a blurry background has mainly to do with your lens. To go from this to this, all I did was change the aperture, which is the first way to get a blurry background. I changed the f-stop on my lens from f22 to f1.8. Here's how you do it. On your camera screen, you'll see the letter f with a number following it. This is your aperture or your f-stop. Change this to be as low as a number as possible. Each camera is a little bit different, but you're usually able to change this by moving one of the wheels on the back of the camera. To get that blurry background, you typically want a lens with f2 or a lower number than that. However, some kit lenses can only go as low as 3.5 or when you zoom in it's 5.6. In this case you can actually get a blurry background by zooming all the way in with your lens and this is the second way. The compression here with the lens is going to help make things blurrier. Another hack is getting closer to the lens. Now this is the third way but this is a little bit too close. I recommend getting a Sigma 16 millimeter 1.4 lens so you can still get a blurry background while having that YouTuber wide angle look. And we have links in the description below for our favorite lenses that are gonna give you a blurry background so make sure you check that out. Another thing you can do, which is our fourth way, is to separate yourself from the background. Moving yourself away from the background is going to give yourself more space from that background, giving you more of that blurry effect. Now, if you're outside and it's too bright to open up your lens to a low number f-stop, try throwing on an ND filter for best results. And that is the fifth way. Click on the screen to find out how you can get better audio in your videos with these four easy steps that you can implement today.